Sunday saw the first game back at the Sheffield Arena since the death of Adam Johnson at the venue, with special tributes for Nottingham's number 47, and a fan ovation in support of Sheffield's Canadian defenceman, Matt Petgrave. We are not showing the exact moment, but in a game last month, it was Petgrave's skate that cut Johnson's neck. On Tuesday, police investigating the incident arrested a man on suspicion of manslaughter, but did not name him. In a statement, South Yorkshire Police said, We have been carrying out extensive inquiries to piece together the events which led to the loss of Adam in these unprecedented circumstances. We have been speaking to highly specialised experts in their field to assist our inquiries. It is very rare for police to lay criminal charges for sports incidents. In 2004, Canucks player Todd Bertuzzi pleaded guilty to assaulting Colorado's Steve Moore. Marty going right after Brashear and he slashed him right in the head. Four years earlier, Marty McSorley of the Bruins was convicted of assaulting the Canucks' Donald Brashear. They're going to have to determine, like in criminal law, that there is a, what we call the mens rea or the uh, intent of committing a crime. Um, codified under their criminal code. Police say the man arrested remains in custody. They have asked for the public to refrain from speculation on the case, which they say could hinder their investigation. Redmond Shannon, Global News, London.